A Tyrannosaurus Rex walks into a bar, orders a beer, but can't reach his wallet. So the barman says, what's with the short arms? And that's what we want to know, too. The trouble with paleontology is that it's just too big to comprehend. That's why scientists agree it's better to break things down into smaller parts. Unfortunately, there's a paleontological paradox that goes something like this. If something looks small and useless, it's going to be incredibly hard to study. And that's where the arms of T-Rex come in. They're one of science's biggest, is it smallest, no, biggest, well, they're an enigma anyway. Each limb was not much longer than a human arm, which means shaking hands would be okay, but you'd need a bit of help getting up there. However, the bones in their arms were much thicker than ours and would have had large muscles to move them. Each one was capable of lifting 400 pounds. A scientific law states that muscle only develops if it's needed to do stuff, so their arms must have been used for something. All scientists can do is hypothesize. Maybe they had a sexual function, perhaps to signal their reproductive status. Or were they a device to allow the male extra purchase during mating? Or maybe they help T-Rex cling on to struggling prey. Other almost plausible theories for T-Rex arms include nest building, egg turning, or just things that they could write themselves with when they fell over. <laughs> I like that one. I guess we'll never know. And in many ways, it's more fun to list things that are not T-Rex career options. Here's a few we came up with. If you can think of jobs that are totally unsuitable for a dinosaur with tiny arms, let us know in the comments below.